ladies. I'm Steph Nash, one of the co-founders of Rumble Cosmetics. Laura and I are here today to show you some great looks for the Kansas Jayhawks. And we're gonna start with the fun fan look. So the fun fan is really an easy to do quick look. We're gonna take the bright white that's a pretty matte white with little gold glimmer sparkles in it. And it's a great color to brighten under the brow. And also, just in case you had any late nights or any reasons to have dark eyes, pop a little bit in the corner. Then I'm gonna take the really pretty gold and tap it all across the lid. Really pretty gold is a great color on any eye color. And this gold was created to really brighten the eye as well. Finally, I'm gonna grab a blender brush and I'm gonna put it into this soft gray and then maybe even a little bit into the blue and I'm gonna blend it right into her crease. And here's a trick for crease too, when you do it on yourself. Open your eye, look into your mirror, and then put your brush, have your eye open, put your brush right in your natural crease. With the eye open then, the color will always go in the right place. So the gray, the little blue, we're gonna add the contour right in the crease. The cool thing about some of these colors too, is if you want them to have a little more dazzle, just get your brush wet and you can add even more color. One of our favorite products in these rumble boxes are these pencils. They glide on beautifully and they add a great lined look. So we're gonna take this navy spark and blend it all along the lash line. Whenever you do eyeliner, you wanna make sure your pencil is nice and sharpened and you're dragging it, not like drawing a line, but you're dragging it with little dabs all the way across your lash line really, really low into the base of your eyelash. Open and look up. Then maybe we want to wrap just a little bit of the color underneath the, for the lower lash line. It's a little more of a current look to wrap the color at the top and the bottom of the eye. Close. Again, make sure your pencil is nice and sharp and then you're doing little dashes right in the base of the eyelash. Open and look up. Then I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to take that blue that's in the KU Rumble Box. And we're going to even blend over that pretty liner. And that can take you kind of one step up to a little bit of a smudged look. Open and look up. The one thing you definitely have to do with these Rumble Boxes is have fun. There's a great palette of colors that was already designed for your team and your fun colors. And these videos are just meant to be a guide, but they're not a must do. So get creative and have fun. I'm gonna take this bronzer blush duo and don't worry about which color you're using. It's gonna be the perfect shade on everyone. I'm gonna blend it onto the apple of the cheek and it gives her a really radiant, pretty, pretty glow. Great product and color for every single day. Look at that. I'm gonna pop some mascara on those lashes. The more the merrier, I think. Look here. And you, you can wiggle at the base to really make your lashes look thick, full, and long. Laura had some on before, but you can always layer on more and more mascara, however you feel comfortable and confident. Finally, let's pick a Jayhawk gloss. For the fun fan look, we're gonna do gold. Look at that, so pretty. I'm gonna take the gold gloss and we're just gonna glisten up the lips, brighten up her smile. She's gonna put it in her handbag and she's off to her party, her tailgate, the field house, wherever she is going to be her pretty and proud female fan. So again, really easy, easy way to use the KU Rumble Box, use the colors within. I hope you guys have a great time. Go Jayhawks! Okay, so we have to teach people really fun tricks that they may or may not know. So one of my favorite is using water on your brush when you have fun metallic or um, shimmery eyeshadows. Any color that is shimmery, this will work with. So I'm gonna choose the gold my brush is damp with a little bit of water and I'm gonna take that same gold that's all over the lid and watch what it does when it's wet. Just by adding water. It makes it high shine, super metallic, 
and really pops the color. Look at this one versus this. Isn't that a great trick for inner corner? Works with frosty whites, golds, even your darker tones fit all over the lid. Thanks, Laura. Laura and Steph are back. We're gonna move from the fun fan look that we've just done, and we are going to glam it up a little bit more. This next look is the flirty fan. So we're gonna take that blue, and we're gonna load it on our blender brush. And then we're going to put it on the outer corner and all in the crease. So we're adding more color and more depth. I want you to take it up a little higher under the brow, and I want you to take it a little bit more in that outer corner and into the crease. See the difference? More pop, more color, just by adding the blue into the crease. So blend it, take it onto the outer corner, blend across the whole crease and a little higher under the brow. Always make sure when you're using colors that maybe you feel like you're kind of timid of, like a dark blue or a red, just use a good brush and don't put too much product on it. You can always add more. Now I'm gonna take a buffer brush, so it's kinda of tight. I'm gonna dip it in the blue, and we're gonna really smoke it out. Open and look up, mainly going from the bottom side. Open and look up. So what this does is it gives her a smoky eye without it just being dark. I'm gonna use my fingers to kinda of just blend away on the bottom. We already have that beautiful bronzer blush duo, but now we're gonna use the red blush and pop a little bit more onto the cheek, right onto the apple. It's kind of an old Bobbi Brown trick. She loves to pop a, um, put a pop of color right onto the apples. Super pretty. Finally, let's pick the really pretty Jayhawk sheer red that just sparkles and glistens, and it's gonna brighten her smile. It's gonna give her a little bit more color than the gold and it's the perfect finishing touch for the flirty fan. Jayhawks are looking hot. Okay, totally hope you guys will take these tips and uh, this, this application and put it to use. Send us your video if you do, we'd love to see it. Hey Jayhawk fans, fun fact. James Naismith, first KU basketball coach, was also the inventor of the game. No wonder why we're so good. Jayhawk fans that are all out glam, we are gonna do the fantabulous look. I got my wet brush, I'm dipping it into the deep Jayhawk blue, and I'm patting it all over the lid. This is totally for that glam fan. That is for that person that really feels confident and comfortable wearing a little bit more makeup. Um, and it's a great smoky eye trick. So just take this look, um, use it with your Jayhawk rumble box, use it with your dark shadow colors, it's super fun and pretty. Because that blue had a little shimmer to it, I could get him wet and make a really metallic smoky eye. Doesn't have to look perfect. I don't have it blended out on the edges at all, but you're gonna do that in your next step. So the first step really is to cover that whole lid with that dark blue. Now if you missed the flirty look, one of the tricks was to use the gold wet in the corner, which is why that looks so cool with that pop into the corner of the lid. All right, now we're gonna take our blender brush and soften the top part with that really pretty bluish gray so that our eye looks blended. A blending brush is a really important tool. A great eyeshadow brush is an important tool. And Rumble has already created great palettes, so you don't have to worry or guess with colors. You just trust that you're gonna put them on and you're gonna look amazing. And that's why we're excited to do these tutorials because you guys can just follow each step, create your own looks, or you can create all three looks that we have made for you. Fun fan, flirty fan, and fantabulous. Don't be afraid to use your fingers if you need to blend off a little bit of the edges. Now I'm even gonna show you how you can use the red a little bit on the eye area. So I'm gonna pop my brush into the red and I'm gonna put it right in the middle on the lid. Super, super fun look. We're gonna come back with that liner. I'm not even gonna blend it out. We wanna make it really cool and fantabulous looking. This is for like the party girl. 
Go back with your glimmery blue liner, add that definition, pop more mascara on. And then last but not least, I've gotta show you guys how to use that beautiful Jayhawk blue. Maybe you've seen, but you maybe haven't seen it on, and it's gorgeous. We're makeup artists, we believe in beautiful quality products, and what happens is it turns really transparent, really glimmery, and does a great, beautiful look on the lips. It almost just makes them look one shade deeper. Tastes good too. <laughs> I'm going to pop a little bit more mascara on her. But take a look at how beautiful that look is for the fantabulous Jayhawk fan. I hope you guys have enjoyed these tutorials. I hope that you'll love the new tips and tricks. Make sure you get your hands on this first edition because we have some really exciting new fun products that will constantly be launched for all of you Jayhawk fans.